If you have been told that you have a vertebral compression fracture in your back and have been suffering in pain, in this video today, I wanna to tell you about what we can offer here at South Texas Spinal Clinic that may be able to not only alleviate your pain, but help prevent further fractures in the future. Hi, my name is Dr. Antonio Webb. I'm an orthopedic spine surgeon here in San Antonio, Texas. So if we break the word down, vertebral compression fracture, vertebral just means the bone in your back. And compression is essentially the collapse of the bone, what the bone does when it's very soft or very brittle, it collapses. And essentially the word fracture just means break. These fractures can be caused by a number of different things, from trauma, from cancer, from infection, from a tumor, but the number one cause is actually caused by osteoporosis, is essentially when your bones are very soft and they're very brittle. Osteoporotic vertebral compression fractures, most of them can be treated with conservative care, with physical therapy, anti-inflammatories, sometimes bracing, and just giving it some time to heal. There are a subset of patients that fail this conservative route. They have continued pain, or they have trouble mobilizing, which means walking. These patients may be a candidate for an outpatient, minimally invasive procedure called a kyphoplasty. This is a procedure where most patients can go home the same day. Once I localize the fracture under x-ray during the procedure, I will then place two small needles into your back and directly into that fracture. This is typically followed by a small balloon. What this balloon will do is inflate the fracture to restore some of its height. And this is typically followed by placing cement into the fractured bone. Essentially, the cement will stabilize the area to restore the height and also prevent any additional movement of those fracture fragments. Most patients are monitored for 30 minutes to one hour following the procedure, and then typically you can go home the same day. It's also important to make sure that your bone health, your quality of your bone is maximized after the procedure. This is typically when we'll send you to one of our bone health nurses and nurse practitioners to essentially obtain a DEXA scan, which is a bone density scan, and also to see what medications that we can possibly give you to optimize your bone health. Hi, my name is Annette Gans. I'm a nurse practitioner who specializes in osteoporosis. Patients come to see me because they're concerned about their bone health. One of the first steps is to do a bone density or DEXA. That machine measures how many minerals are inside the bone and compares it to somebody who has perfect bone mass. Depending on those results, we may want to do some further testing. If you have been told that you have a vertebral compression fracture in your back and have been suffering in pain, well, I invite you to contact our office today to see if you're a candidate for this minimally invasive outpatient procedure that can essentially help you live a pain-free life. I'm Dr. Antonio Webb, and I look forward to seeing you soon.